Hello friends, welcome to Eltropic Cells. If you like our channel, please don't forget to like, share, subscribe and press the bell icon for getting further notifications. Hi friends, welcome to Eltropic Cells. It's a 49 inch Panasonic LED TV. You can see this is the model number. In this TV, the complaint is no display issue due to panel related fault. So let's start the repair. See friends, now we open the backer of the TV. Here you can see this is the model number. This is the motherboard of the TV. This is the inverter board. And this is the power supply board. Here you can see it's a LG panel. Here you can see the LG Ticon board. It's a 49 inch LG panel is used in this TV. See friends, this is the fault. Here you can see no picture issue. Also, there is another fault here you can see a blue tin display. It's because of bad, bad backlight. It's the blue shaded tin color is because of backlight related fault. See friends, this is the t board. So here you can see these are the gate signal tracks from the left side of the panel. And these are the gate signal tracks from the right side of the panel. So. Here, first I am going to block the gate signals entering to the panel from the right side of the panel through this FFC cable from the from the take on board. These types of components are mainly due to internal shorting in gate signals inside the glass panel. Due to this internal shorting, the shorting will be either from the left side or right side of the glass panel. So due to this internal shorting, the DC to DC AC goes to protection mode, which is the reason for this issue. So here using taping method here we now blocked the gate signals from the right side now let us turn on the TV and check the picture remember that this is just only a temporary solution and the permanent solution is panel replacement see friends after blocking the gate signals in the right side the complaint remains same so now let us again remove this modification from the right side gate signal and then try to block the left side gate signal tracks see friends after removing the taping from the right side FFC cable now we reconnected the right side FFC cable to this take on board now let us block the left side gate signal tracks it's around 13 pins we need to block so remember that this is just only a temporary solution the permanent solution is panel replacement and we cannot predict how long the display will work using this method it completely depends on luck basis The permanent solution is panel replacement. See friends, now using the taping method here we block the gate signals from the left side of the panel. Now let us turn on the TV and check the picture again. See this blue shaded color shade is because of backlight related fault. You can see the complaint remains same. So let me check again that the left side FFC cable is properly inserted or not. So let us again reconnect the left side FFC cable. See friends, now we again connect the left side FFC cable and here we properly block the gate signal tracks from the 
left side using taping method so using a cello type here we mask the gate signals ending to the panel through the left side now let us turn on the tv and check the picture see friends now the tv is turned on see friends here you can see now the picture comes and the complaint is solved successfully remember that this is just only temporary solution and the permanent solution is panel replacement here in this tv you can see a blue color tint issue it's because of backlight so to get the accurate color in this tv we need to replace the backlight also so at present condition now we repair the panel by removing the shorting from the left side gate signal by masking it using a taping method so that's it now the panel is repaired successfully remember that this is just only a temporary solution permanent solution is panel replacement so hope you like this video see you in another video with another interesting topics thank you for watching